Tuesday, September 11th, 2001. Uh, galley flight attendant and our purser is in staff. And we can't get a, the cockpit, but the door won't open. America's under threat from a new type of warfare. Hello? Unprepared, unequipped, and incapable to take back control of the sky. Yeah, American 11. Uh, we suspect there's someone in the cockpit that's taken over. We have Air traffic controllers along the east coast of America are thrust into chaos and confusion. Nobody move, please. We're going back to the airport. Don't try to make any stupid moves. Yeah, 175, go ahead. Yeah, we figured we'd wait to go to your center. Um, we heard a suspicious transmission uh, on our departure out of Boston. Amidst the panic, Voices of America's first line of aerial defense crackle over the comms. I just weapon, Sergeant Powell. All right, Boston Center, Team U. We have a, a problem here. We have a hijacked aircraft headed towards New, New York. I don't yeah. know where I'm scrambling these guys to. I need a direction. Uh, Official civilian uh, aviation and military recordings provide the greatest of, uh, understanding of what unfolded that wet, fateful day. Do you know who he is? We just, we just, we don't know who he is. We're just picking him up now. All right, heads up, man. It looks like another one. All right. Man. Exposing flaws in the operational and procedural protocols of the civilian FAA and military bodies. Military Boston Center just had a report that American 11 is still in the air and it's on its way towards heading towards Washington. American 11 is still in the air. Discover the disarray, distress, and devastation caused in chaos on the comms. We need to get those fighters screwed over Manhattan because we don't know how many guys are out of bar. Could be three, two, could be more.